Waiter, I'll take a gray goose. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Welcome to What Am I Wearing? Country Club Edition. No, this is not Grey Goose, it's water. But what I like to do is I like to save nice vodka bottles and then reuse them as water bottles. When you put them in the refrigerator, the glass gets really cold. So when you take it out of the refrigerator, it stays colder longer than a normal water bottle. And it just feels nice to drink out of a Grey Goose bottle. And I don't think it's a crime to feel nice while just wanting to hydrate yourself. But what am I wearing? I'm doing a country club edition because my job, Spectrum Athletic Clubs, the gym, the health club, has just been bought by Bay Club from the Bay Area. And it's like their first initial push into the Southern California area location. So we are now like a country club. So in response to that, I want to show a little country club look I would wear, you know, if I'm out on the fields playing golf, some tennis, badminton, you know, some of that extra white people shit. This is what I would wear. And I look like I have a lot of money, don't I? It's all an illusion. It's all an illusion. The hat. I got this mesh cap. Daiso Japan, $2. $2. Usually everything's 150, but this was marked otherwise. But two dollars. It's beautiful. Ooh. And you can never have too much white mesh. My top, I got it from uh, the original coal outlet. Rest in peace, the store is no longer open. But it was like two dollars. No, it was really cheap because I was buying hella stuff that day. And then I saw this and I was like, I had to have it. And there was like no fucking like price tag on it anywhere. And the girl could find it. And then she was like, two dollars. You know, I'm tr I couldn't find my other gold chain, the nicer one. That, that would fit this look better because you're not going to go to a country club in a rope chain. Like, come on, let's be real. And plus, if you're on the field playing tennis or badminton and you're moving around, this just going to hit you in the face. So my other chain, it's smaller, it's golder, it pops, it kind of matches more with my watch. Um, but I can't fucking find it anywhere, so I just use this instead. Five dollars. Got it at the Rose Bowl flea market. Look at it. And that's a nice rope chain. I've been meaning to get another one. I want to get a bigger one. Have a gold Michael Kors watch. So actually, I think it's for a girl, but I do have small petite wrists. And then I have a, um, it's a little, it's like a white gold tennis bracelet. Is it a tennis bracelet? I don't even know what a tennis bracelet looks like, but this is my version of a tennis bracelet, if it's not a tennis bracelet. It was from my grandpa. It says um, C.L. Braithwaite on here. Braithwaite is my middle name. That's my mother's maiden name. And C.L., his name was uh, Carl. I don't know what his middle name was because honestly, I don't really know. I didn't really know him. But he passed away. But I did get my love for photography from him and this white gold tennis bracelet. So thank you, Grandpa Carl, wherever you are. Got my gold septum, got the gems in the ear, you know, I'm going up. I'm going off, I'm going off to play some golf, I'm going off to play some tennis, some badminton. You know, I fucked with badminton in PE when we had to do that. I fucked with badminton. Country club realness, done on a budget. This is what I would wear. It's alternative, it's mesh, it's spring, it's summer, it's white, it's elegant. It looks nice. The Grey Goose got your girl feeling loose. Sad Boys 2001. Emotional shoddies. Recap, white mesh cap, two bucks, Daiso Japan. Gold rope chain, five bucks, Fair, uh, Rose Bowl Flea Market. White mesh top, two bucks, original coal outlet, Michael Kors watch. Don't even know how much this watch is, but I'm sure it's the most expensive thing I'm wearing. And family heirloom tennis bracelet. Until next time, I'm Zane, aka Supernova Boy. Don't forget to subscribe, and until next time, bye. Hey guys, Zane here, aka Supernova Boy. This is my fifth video of the day. 
Big Bang's loser reaction coming up to you 